Hey, Cal, good to see you. I know what you are, for what it's worth. Do you now? Sure. The way you carry yourself. That saber on your belt. I won't say anything, of course. Why not? The bounty could be your ticket off-world. And I've already told you enough about my past business to land me in an Imperial intake yard. Guess I'll have to settle for honor among outlaws. Look, I know what it's like to have a losing streak tied around your throat. And I respect anyone who keeps fighting, even when the chips are down. You're a hard man to read, Moran. Then, as they say, I've still got it. Seeing these High Republic ruins with my own eyes... How do you go back to the Academy after that? Not something I expected to hear from a historian. I didn't expect it either. Originally, I couldn't wait to wall myself into a library. Why visit one dig site when you could read about 30, right? So what made you decide to leave? It is hard to describe, but the more I learned, the more I wanted to get my hands dirty and live it. Not just read about it on a calf-stained terminal, you know? See you around, Cal. Some other time, okay? Greetings, Sojourner. Just Cal will do. It will not. Okay. You don't look like the other prospectors. No, no, no. They unearth riches. Tulak excavates that which cannot be so easily grasped. Make a lot of credits in that line of work? Wisdom is a good that never decays and is always in short supply. Sojourner. You smell of smoke and sand. I should take another shower then. Talk to you later, Two Locked. Go back. Perceptive. Also not as dumb as I first thought. Thanks. Go on now. I'm busy. You ever leave this booth? Thinking about it. Wouldn't hold your breath though. Barkeep. Good to see you, Cal. Word is there's a traveling troubadour and a DJ droid from the Core Worlds on Kobo. Not what I expected you to say. Any idea why they're there? They've hiked out onto the Valley Plateau to sample the sounds of the wild. And the sounds of the wild can come from creatures that kill you. Can't drop those beats if you're dead. I'll see if I can find them. I suspected as much. So you and Grease have any big dreams for this cantina? Well, there's a stage collecting dust. Perhaps one day we'll hire some off-world bands. That sure help us stand out. I'd say standing out isn't your problem. Fair point. But just so you know, the band at my previous gig packed more heat than a hot solder guard. And until this raider situation is under control, let the music play on. Hey, sport. Can't chat now. Keeping an eye on those two treasure hunters who just showed up. Till next time, pal. Private table. All right, then. Whoa, easy, Grok. Sorry about my friend here. He's just a little guarded. Yeah, I get it. Hmm. <laughs> Name's Dana. You might say my partner and I have a talent for turning opportunity into profit. I'm Cal. This is BD. Noisy little thing. We're thinking of heading to Dredger Gorge. Ever been? Once or twice. I'd be careful out there. That's gang turf. Gang turf? Grok! I'm sure it ain't that bad. The hell I'm risking my neck on gang turf. <laughs> hey, it was great meeting you, Cal. Got some business to discuss with my old pal here. <laughs> Come on, BD. So how'd you two meet anyway? I'll start with this Merc crew I joined. Grok had been recruited a few months earlier. On account of my good looks. That's right. Mm, and me on account of being the smoothest thing since Hut Blubber. 
Anyways, things were good until our outfit tried to pull one over on the Empire. So we... We took off and started our own thing. The rest of the outfit ended up dead or in prison. What the car, Grok? I was telling it. Kid doesn't need our whole life story. Uh-uh. Point is, Grok and I realize that we're better off just the two of us. We know the feeling. Talk later, buddy. Hey, got a sec? Looks like I've met your whole crew, Cal. The old crew, that is. <laughs> Seemed like there was some tension between you and Seer, huh? It's always a little strange seeing someone after being apart for years. Hmm. Don't have too many people like that in my life. Well, that probably says more about me than you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it's just me and Kata. And that's not as much as I can handle these days. The more people in your life, the more you can lose. You know? When Kobo's moon was shattered, the Republic settlement collapsed, leaving those spires. That place isn't just an old ruin. It's a tomb. Might just be Grease's stew talking, but this place is beginning to grow on me. How long have the Raiders been here? A few years. Not long after I arrived. I don't know a planet in the Outer Rim free of Raiders in general, but these Bedlam bastards have changed Kobo forever. Most hunters know you call when you need to, and you stop hunting when a herd gets too low. These raiders kill for sport, and made a lot of those beasts much more hostile to us. Take Shiverpedes, for example. When they lose habitat, they get territorial and fight back. Same as us, really. Sure enough. Biggest mistake our kind ever made was thinking we are any different. Watch yourself out there. You do the same, Mosey. I know things are pretty tough right now, but think about the old days. Remember that scrape on Dathomir, Kashyyyk? That was a close call, but now it's even more dangerous. I wonder what it'll be like on the other side of all this, you know? Assuming we live through it. Not now, Cal. I'm pretty sure Monk reorganized my entire spice rack. But I don't know exactly what he changed. But I don't hate it. Ha! Huh. Could he actually know what he's doing? After being back on the menace, this saloon is looking filthy by comparison. Maybe some cleaning will help. up okay fine thanks it's not the first time this frontier has been terrorized by marauders you know but once more the noble jedi knights rise to the occasion i appreciate the thought see but we should watch the whole noble knight stuff yes uh, of course good luck tracking down those leads and please do let me know if you find anything stay safe and keep an eye out for more raiders Oh, I will. May the force be with you, Cal. Behold, Imports! Can't go wrong with this. confess something. Here we go. That tech I tried to sell to Ravis, there's more of it in the valley. A building right in the center. You can't miss it. We've already been there, Turgle, but thanks for the tip. Really? Well, is it too late to say that we split whatever you find 50-50-50? Maybe next time. I'm gonna hold you to that. I wish I could be a fearless warrior like you, but I can't. So I'm glad you're around. 
You scrap anything useful out here? Tons. As soon as something breaks or the raiders show face, folks abandon their projects. So Kobo's a gold mine for scrappers like us. <laughs> you got that right. Great to see you. You can really see how a world like this would attract all sorts of people. What in the blazes are you talking about? Well, the High Republic was a time of idealism, growth, the great works, the beacon. And Kobo was right in the middle of it. This world is a window into a golden age. You see all that in your ancient trinkets. Hey, this stuff is not ancient. Hell, we're still using relays from the Rimward expansions. All right, all right. All I'm saying is that you shouldn't go romanticizing this place. Stick around too long and it changes. You take Turgil, for instance. He wasn't always like that? Come to think of it, bad example. Well, hey there, Traveler. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> don't mind the beast. She don't like strangers. The mountain don't neither. You be careful. I'll try. Thanks. Prospector's folly, we call it. Pretty treacherous. Crawling with all kinds of dangers. Sounds like our kind of place. <laughs> There's stuff beyond these crags that make your blood run cold. Oh, we could tell you some stories. BD1. My bottom old mum dubbed me Scuba Stev. Scuba the Fisher, am I? You know, there's a fish tank down in Pylon Saloon that could use some attention. Pylon Saloon? That'll have infested watering hole down in your valley. All right, all right. You know, yeah. Ah, fine, twist my arm. I'll do it. Meet me at the saloon and we'll appraise this so called tank. <laughs> ah, can you could have stay away? You don't even say the seas play once it's missed in your gums. I guess not. You're the aspect of a fish a lad. And uh, lucky for you, we're perched just above the lair of the sea fish. Sea fish, huh? That's right. An impossible catch. No fisher in the right mind would pursue such a quarrelsome foe. No fisher, but Scuba Stev. That was pretty impressive. You still think I'm small time, eh? No, I believe. Well then, 
have no choice but to regale you with my bleak most history. Tell me a moment, and I'll tell you a thing or two about old Scuba Stain. So, you wish to prick up your ears and receive the tale of Scuba? If you're sharing stories, we'll listen. Then you be a fool, my lad. A sordid tale will bring you nothing but grief and woe. Okay, well, if you're not sharing stories, we'll... Go oh, fine, I'll tell you. At your own assistance, and at your own peril. My story begins at a small village on the frozen banks of Sakavi Tar. My home world. Nights black as quellfish in it. Winter so cold, a stern look can turn you to glass. Doesn't sound like the easiest place to grow up. Difficult, eh? From the moment your mother's milk froze on your tongue to the moment you found it on frozen streets. You see, the fishes, they had the right of it. They dwelt far below the ice, where warm currents danced like ribbons in the wind. To fish so scarce a quarry, on account of the great fish famine, well, it's nearly a mild undertaking. But for all the belly aching now, there's a peaceful enough life for a wee Sakavian with an instinct for the rod. So you discovered your talent early. Such a talent was I, that as a lad, me hardly spotted my first prickly chin here. I was given an audience with Undun. But that'd be a tale for another time. Oh, and uh, some advice, lad. If you're planning to scale the mountain, you'll need to give a strong grip. Thanks. lift platform here. See what's up ahead, buddy. through, officer. <laughs> Nothing that ain't made of Dura steel is passing through this electron wall. Weapon's hot, sir. Let's shoot it before he gets ideas. Negative. We've got our orders. Sure you can't make an exception? You smell that, scum? That's imperial air you're breathing. So get back before I forget my orders and we see how tough you really are. Why don't you drop the shield and we'll find out? Nice try, Furman. Lucky for you, this gate's got a remote switch. Only base command can open it. Yeah, or we'd tear you to scraps. Clamp it, trooper. I'm handling it. Copy that, sir. Block. You will lower the shield. I... Uh... I already showed you my authorization. You... 
already showed me your authorization. Uh, sir? TK-783 to base command. Lower the shield. What? Wait, what the? The shell is down! Blast him! Won't be easy. Think of the rewards, Shanna. Come on. Okay. Another shard. Well, something for the garden.
Defend me. Nice. I'm Cal. This is BD-1. Are you here to rescue us? We were just exploring. How long you been here? We have been trapped down here for at least a standard cycle. Maybe more. We? Ah, oh, yes. It is just me. And has been for some time. But you have cleared the way. Are the raiders gone then? We took care of them. Maybe you should leave before more come. Yes. I will return to the outpost at Rambler's Reach. We... Had a domicile there. I hope to see you again. The outpost, yes. I wonder how much of our old home remains. I will leave for Rambler's Reach soon. But first, I must gather my thoughts. <coughs> I... I barred the passage. I'm... I'm sorry. Farewell. Oh, the smell down here is potent. Back to it. Raiders have rigged this place. Don't think I'll be able to move it. I can call the lift from here.
I'm looking. You know your way around Kobo, don't you? You got it! Grab a lift, Beatty. Better catch up. Could be useful in the garden. Easy, Neko. BD-1, over here.
You too. Is this the home you were talking about? Correct. Within there are some... possessions. I don't suppose they will need them anymore. So feel free. Look around. Are you sure? I have no need for them. For your help, I insist. skills? Medicine, surgery, healing. What happened in those caverns was terrible. And I was powerless to help. I will learn to prevent that, Cal. It's hard to stop suffering in this galaxy, but always worth the effort. Here for the soundscape, too? Hey, back. I heard there was someone collecting samples up here. That's right, man. Dee Dee's been all over these glider calls. <laughs> oh, it's sounding great. You know, Hyloon Saloon down in the outpost is starving for some live entertainment. Hmm. Might not be a bad call. Dee Dee swore one of those beasts gave him some side eye. <laughs> yeah, we're in. We'll catch you back at the outpost. See you there. Dee Dee and I are just gonna finish up here. <laughs> Chill, Dee Dee. I ain't rushing you. That's it. Guess we're friends now, huh?
Let's show this to Z. Must be the way out. How to get there? Ready to go. Here we go. Jedi's are the long list of things I need to avoid on this rock. Battle is required for conquest. For you, lady. Survival is required for me. That's all.
Someone locked it up. Maybe we can find another way in. Now that better? There's a good Neko. You just stay here now, all right? And be quiet. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. Come on, Echo. Now! <laughs> uh. 
You know your way around Kobo, don't you? recognize you. You're friends with Grease, right? Yeah. If he asks about the 50 credits, I may or may not owe him. Tell him I left the planet. I think I'll stay out of this. Well, if you won't lie for strangers, who will you lie for? know your way around Kobo, don't you? We should be getting pretty close. I don't see anything like a settlement, though. That's the way through. Let's do it. Places in ruins. Quick! Do it, Captain! 
up your trail outside the outpost. Cal. Sounds like you've been watching us. <gasps> We've all been watching, Cal. Not every newcomer introduces themselves by taking down one of Ravis's boys, which, by the way, nice touch, love a big entrance. Thanks. So what do you want? <sighs> what I want, Cal, is to reward you for every one of these that you take down. Not the only one who came to Kobo for a little peace and quiet. Take these off, bounty hunters, and I'll trade you something nice. So he was Haxian Brute. More bound to be on the way. Exactly. Lucky for you. I've got eyes and ears about. Drop by the saloon, and I'll help you get a jump on those hunters. All right. I'll think it over. Everybody's got rockets except me. Not a bad find. Come on, buddy. We still gotta find Dagon's retreat. the planet and everything connected then reach out i think i uh, uh, there I, I felt it just so very good parawan
will this piece of junk work? Maybe I'll just smash this stupid thing apart. got to be the place Cordova was talking about. Let's stop for a moment. Come on, buddy. We're not the only ones looking for something here. Think it could be Dagon? A coupler. Power source should be nearby. Welcome, Jedi. Is that Centauri Cree? All right, all right. Let's look. Learn to harness Kobo matter in order to prepare yourself to traverse the abyss. But in success, will you also find an ever greater connection to the Force? I understand, Master. Now may I be excused? You have somewhere to be. Very well, but return later. Thank you. I will.
your connection with the Force guide you towards our shared goal, Tananor. Centauri Kree was training Jedi for the journey through the Abyss. that updraft across? Stay safe, you hear? Z can decrypt this for us. Let's catch that updraft. addition to our guard.
center myself. Okay, I'm ready. Public reaches out to you. There are new opportunities to share and learn, and this planet has much to teach us. What did you learn, Centauri? secrets this place is hiding. Kobo matter. It's overgrown. We believe Kobo matter originates from deep within the abyss. This strange substance is enigmatic, but not beyond our ability to study and manipulate. Like all things, once understood, it can be channeled and thus controlled. Neat trick, buddy. Stim, please, buddy. Together, the Republic and the Jedi Order can understand the mysteries of the galaxy and harness them for the greater good. The Force guides our path. Sounds like the Order I remember. 
Everything Cree built here was destroyed by a catastrophe she couldn't foresee. Sometimes it feels like history just repeats itself. Master Kree talking of their dreams for the Abyss. It is unbecoming to gossip and to eavesdrop. Yes, Master. My apologies. Should be able to ride the updraft to the far side now. Who ask questions find answers. I bet Z can get the data off this disk. Welcome, Jedi. Enemies of peace threaten the galactic frontier and our Republic. Once we cross the Abyss, Tannenor could be a bastion to repel that threat. 
A beacon for hope and justice across the Outer Rim. Tantalor was more than a mission to her. It was a dream of a better future. Another chamber over there. Yeah, let's check it out.
Let's search inside. Another little while. What is it Dakin expects me to find? sending them out for something, and we're following the same trail. We need to use this. Buddy, over here. Buddy, stem. devices. Uh, this one's broken too. He is coming. Destroy it now. Centauri's devices. Dad can kill Jedi for destroying it. I think this could be our answer. Let's bring this back to Master Cordova. Unstoppable as ever, BD. Oh, nice. I think Master T'Pol had this one. That window leads back outside. We should take this back to Jeddah. Master Cordova will want to see what we found.
to the left. has known to stun his quarry with a blinding flash of light. I guess you have a plan, though, right? Oh, ho, 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 Cal, you, you kindly lover. Ah, sometimes I forget you're only half cooked around the gills. The reef fish has attracted less kindly fishers, however. Once, I knew a noble who deigned to keep one as a pet. by greed, huh? Something in your brain? Aye, boy. The subtle art of catching a fish. The art of focus. And in the dark, with nothing but the bristles on your chin for company, that focus is special. From that day forward, when I plunge my line into the frigid waters, it would emerge with a fish. Three times out of seven. That's less than half. My village told me that I'd be the one to save them from the great fish famine. Little did I know that the grapnel was soon to arrive on our shores. Gonna assume that's a bad thing. Perhaps, lad. And perhaps not. But that'll be a story for another time.
about my family trying to communicate is that we would prefer not to die out here. Good, Neko. Yeah. Still here. Waiting on the Excuse me. Would you be so kind as to dispatch this? We'll make it worth your while. my warrior friend I haven't seen such fighting since the championship we are in your debt what are you doing out here we were out looking for the biggest strongest beasts to fight each other winner take all within our hollow tactics game table of course hollow tactics huh that's right and you have just helped us gather beastly data for our game just as soon as we find a place to set up shop of course my friend might be interested. He runs Pyloon Saloon. Ah, uh, yes. The saloon at Rambler's Reach. That dump? I didn't realize it was open. Well, tell you what. We're more than happy to bring holler tactics to Pyloons. Good liven up the place. Let us make haste, Tully Moo. All things in their own time, Bima. See you around. Great find. Good, Neko. Come on. Don't kill me! Kill you? I just saved your fool leg. Who are you anyway? I'm Turgle. Well, if you won't keep breathing, you best follow me. This is raider territory.
Another bounty puck. We should show this to Cage. <laughs> Ready to ride. Good find, Beatty. Making me work for it, huh? Got something? Thank you. 
Strength. We pledge ours to you. You are wise, Tenille. Tell your dissenters I have no place for them. They opposed me. Now only death remains.
programming. No Jedi can have company. Get the enemy, blockhead! Switch out. Finish it! Enemy encounter. your belly aching, Leo. Let me see it. Shoot. That ain't gonna heal. Sorry, hun. Not your day. Way of the world, Leo. Rather you in the ground peaceful than someone's dinner. Let's go. I wonder how long this has been here. I hear you, BD. Let's see.
seeds. Wonder if they'll grow in our garden. Prospectors didn't stand a chance. Get around faster now. Get in there and fight. Time to go. The, the charge is set. Get back. What? Nothing? Uh, I thought you said this was good thermite. It's okay, BD. We'll find another way. Time to ride, buddy. Come on! We can trade this at Doma's shop.
Good luck. I'll keep things ticking here. Let's take a look at... Shut oh. it is. Think Cordova can make some sense of that tech Cal found? Are you kidding me? That guy is as sharp as they come. I can't wait to see Sierra again. I owe her big time. She fronted me the credits for Pyloons. How much do you owe her, Grease? Two thousand credits, give or take. Maybe I'll make Granny Pyloons famous casserole and she'll forget all about it. For two thousand credits? That better be one hell of a casserole. Grab some seat, Cal. Coming in, Grease? I'll catch up. I'm gonna stay on the Manus check diagnostics. 
Well, if you need repairs, I'm sure the Anchorites would be happy to help. Oh, no thanks. I don't want those weirdos rooting through my ship. I can feel those Anchorites watching me from behind their masks. I agree, but how can we be sure it's safe? We cannot. The network's resources are stretched thin, and some local leaders are unwilling to accept the risks. How can we convince them? Many fear that accepting refugees will put a target on their back. Cal, you're back. Did you find anything? Think so. Good. Cordova will be glad to hear it. Safe travels, Cal. How did you and the Anchorites end up building this archive? Well, we began our work in the holy city of Nijeda, preserving whatever we could find of the Jedi tradition. Sounds like a dangerous place to collect outlawed teachings. Too dangerous. After one too many close calls with the Empire, I convinced the Narcus to relocate here. We found this abandoned monastery. We set about building everything you see. I can't believe you did all this in only a couple of years. Well, it's been hard work. Once I understood my calling, I had to answer it. That you did. It hurt when you left. Felt like you quit on us in the middle of a fight. I know. But you were trying to restore the order. Rebuild what was lost. The fight was never your goal. Are you so sure it's yours? I can't talk. A strange device. This one seems to be a duplicate. Both have been damaged by lightsabers. Wasn't me. This time. Perish the thought, hmm? You think you can fix it? I don't know. But I will certainly try. Master Junda, the Empire is near in Pilgrim Sanctuary. Is it a strike force? No, an excavation team. Good. They don't know about the safe house. Yet. Safe house? Hidden in the ruins. Have we begun evacuations? They're already underway, but Brother Armias isn't responding. Armias has the communication codes. If they capture him, they could put the entire hidden path at risk. I know the ruins. I will go. I'm coming with you. Boat? You know what? I think I should stay here. Make myself useful. I could use a research assistant. Bring back Armias. You got it. And no heroics. With this one? No promises. I think she was talking to you. Is the safe house far? No, but we will need a spammel to get there. They gather near the base. Follow me. What was this place? An old anchorite monastery. <clears throat> Impressive, isn't it? Yeah. Pilgrim Sanctuary is an ancient temple. Seer and Master Cordova chose it as the hidden path safe house. We knew one day the Empire would come, just not so soon. Master Junda told us of your coming. It is an honor to meet one she holds in such high regard. May I escort you? I have never met a witch before, and I have so many questions. Pilgrim's Crossing is on the other side of the desert. This way, Master Junda. We are nearly there. 
So, what do you think? It's old, abandoned, and in the middle of nowhere. It's perfect. Have you been here before? Yes. I once saved a pilgrim from a stormtrooper not far from here. Here's our ride. Let's hope this spammel doesn't abandon us. Don't hold the grudge, Cal. It's not you. Let's stop. Slow down now. It's easy to get lost out here. Then it is a good thing you have a guy. Ready, Marin? Right behind you. Easy, friend. <laughs> What's something you learned traveling the galaxy? That sometimes it is best not to ask questions and to keep your eyes on the path ahead.
Something to help me. involved with a hidden path. I came across someone in need during my travels and helped them hide from the Empire. That eventually led me to the path. Sometimes, I wonder if destroying the Holocron had any impact. We protected the children on that list. But there are others. And the Empire's still hunting them down. Just so. We must protect those we can. Space. Yes, they are ancient security mechanisms, a remnant of those who came before. When the Empire arrived, the Anchorites began to use these. Old tech is less conspicuous. safe house is in there? Yes. The temple is abandoned and well fortified. Perfect place to hide from the Empire. So we thought. We'll find Brother Armaius. I hope so. We will take the back route. It is the fastest way. That looks like trouble. At least there's two of us. One for each of its flaws. <laughs> A fight! Like old times. I'm locking them down. Here. 
nasty things. Did you find the way to Tanalor? Not yet. But we found some devices from the High Republic. Master Cordova's inspecting them now. Seer and her master are quite the pair. They've been a vital asset to the path since they joined us. Did you come across any other Jedi on your travels? No, Cal. If I had, I would have contacted you. Thank you. A shortcut to Sears base. Empire's closing in. Let's split up. I will slow their progress. We'll regroup near the temple. Hey, Marin. Watch yourself out there. I'll be doing the watching, pal. Just you and me again. Can't get through. Welcome, traveler. Though your journey started long ago.
Careful not to touch anything here. Don't want to wake the dead. Can I get a spin, buddy? Devoted to the very end. But to what cause? Let's take this back to Sears, Arnett. Let's try that again, BD. We'd make it eventually. <laughs> A map of the region. There's Pilgrim Sanctuary across the bridge. I wonder what those markers mean. <laughs> Brace yourself, BD. This remind you of Zeppo too? Make that too windy.
that before? Almost like music. What kind of pilgrims came out here anyway? Imagine crossing these gales just to find a safe place. Guess you can't put a price on sanctuary. Marin mentioned this was the back route, right? Hope Seer's got another way for these refugees. They've been through enough. That should give us some cover. clear. Now. 
Empire's been keeping busy. Why didn't the Empire give us a nickname? We better get this back to the Archive. Toss me a stim. ready for these conditions. And it doesn't hurt to have a desert ghost on our side. Maybe the wind's turning in our favor for once. Traveler, cross over. Cross over what? Okay, let's go. Go check on the new unit. It's not responding to comms. Ready? 
Rest, reflection, direction. Onwards, traveler. Encouraging. It just won't open. brought a new toy. Find something? Off course around here. Let's move carefully. Miss them.
Watching out for us, buddy. Give us a boost. Seek not the path, return to stillness, traveler, and the way reveals itself. Easy to say when you're already resting in peace.
Glad you're excited. Hmm. Android with its master. Can't use this lift yet. Now, you can make it. I'm Cal. This is BD1. I'm Peely. Didn't expect to see any pilgrims today. What are you doing out here? Tending to what I can, but very little grows here, as you can see. You should check out the Kobo system. Everything grows there. Sounds lovely. Perhaps I will. Just tell the bartender of Pylon Saloon I sent you. He'll get you set up. Odd place for a garden. I'd been feeling rather aimless. So, like the pilgrims, I came to find a new direction. When I came across these struggling seeds, I had to tend to them. I'm amazed anything grows out here. <laughs> Life is stubborn like that, I suppose. I know this effort was futile, but it is my duty as a botanist. I understand, but this is a desert. These are hardly the conditions for life to thrive. I know that. Perhaps I never wanted to admit that. Your efforts aren't wasted. But sometimes you need to know when to walk away. It's not defeat. It's just redirection. Hmm. I shall think on that, Cal. Stay safe, Peely. The imps are all around us. I believe I'll take your advice and head to the Kobo system. See you there someday, I hope. This leads up to the bridge. in the desert. She must have been really lost or desperate to find her way. Formation looks familiar.
I heard you. Not sure I understand, though. Tis the noise, lad. A fisher must be master of all the senses, eh? We're in the lair of the fan-tailed lawfish, the greatest smell of things foul beyond the deep core. Are you saying we smell foul? You know the foul peach. Damn it, to worry. Being clever, I can to apply the pungent musk of the glotsam crab to me suit. Oh, the old fishy won't know what happened. Stop here.
the Pilgrim Sanctuary. Let's take this to Sister Task. a break. I did what I could, but there is an Imperial unit up ahead. Thought I should warn you. Sounds good. Lead the way. Yeah. 
to the temple yet? No. But I have heard imps talking of a new excavation machine. Let's move. Baron? One moment. Still impressive. You have not seen the true extent of my powers, Calcastus. Can you make that? Not without some help. Then it is good this path was designed to guide the winds. Over here, Cal! Hear that? The ruins are singing. It's coming from that chamber. Then you must find a way in. Now or never. Place is strong in the force.
feeling so great, PD. Welcome back. Hey. The Imperial labor camp on Maza. Garrison's half empty. We can strike before reinforcements arrive. Sounds promising, but Marin and Grease haven't made it back to the ship yet. As soon as they do, I'll scout ahead and they can rest on the Mantis. You know they'll never allow themselves to rest if you're in danger. <laughs> you never give up. And that's what inspires all of us. But you have to remember that where you lead, they will follow. I know I've been pushing recently, but ever since Grease what got hurt... What happened to Grease is not your fault. But ever since then, you've been reckless. I keep worrying about something bad happening to one of you. It's good to acknowledge your fear. But don't let it determine your path. Focus on the moment. Choose your direction and act with certainty. And trust that, whatever the odds, you'll pull through. Cal, trust yourself. Trust in the Force. Exactly. Back now. Focus on the moment. And push through! We gotta take this storm head on. Brace yourself, BD. He always knows where to guide me. Even if I don't know my next step. Cal, what happened? See for yourself. Not bad. Maybe you can keep up with me now. Let's find out. What's the Empire up to? They're at the temple entrance, waiting for something. And we still got time.
strike that monstrosity. Be careful. I'll see you inside. Let's stop for a moment. Winds are with us now. Truly, the craft is lit. Starting excavation on the. They're after you. That drill will take time to set up. Hope Marin can slow them down. Doing BD? Having fun back there?
Incredible, but that won't stop the Empire from reducing it to rubble. threat. By my side. Look at this.
gotta hurry. Brother Armias can't hide forever. You know what to do. Sanctuary to all who seek it. Sounds too good to be true. Pilgrim Sanctuary should prove a worthy location for the safe house. Its proximity to the Archive is ideal. And with a bit of your slicing, this temple could once again provide safe haven for those who need it most. <laughs>